five castle steps in the upper town has over the last few weeks become an attraction in its own right. A mural of an octopus now decorates a building. Its legs in movement leading you up the steps whilst encircling the structure. The project, the idea of three architects who met at university, with a building being developed by two of them. So why this particular design? They're doing this wonderful project, which is the renovation of this building. And when Alex showed me an elevation, I just, it just was calling out for an octopus. Uh, I love painting octopuses. They are lovely to paint. And um, just the sheer scale of it was like going to be really important. So we went for it. I did a project and um, yeah, it took a year and a half to discuss it. Now you've worked on murals before, but this is uh, the largest one that you've done. So I imagine it presented certain challenges, the shape uh, of the building, the scale, the, the area, the space around it. Absolutely. It was terrifying, actually. <laughs> and I've had a year and a half to be terrified. But um, uh, my friends, Alex and Elaine, have been so enthusiastic about it. I couldn't back down and uh, managed to get my head around it, drew up an elevation to scale. And then, as I was telling you, we gridded the building up. It was all done old school, but it all worked out really well. I'm really happy. A unique design and personal project here in the upper town. Art can be subjective, but this mural seems to be generally welcome, although it has created and generated interest and debate. I mean, it's all, it's all about having a bit of fun. Um, we, as, as Alex says, we do a lot of work in Gibraltar as architects, but this was actually uh, something that we did off our own backs. And uh, doing the, the, the mural was something quite special um, because um, it allows Jessica to express um, and to open up sort of some some freedom in, in the sort of um, contemporary art and, and um, spontaneous art in Gibraltar. What do you think it actually adds to the upper town of Gibraltar? It's an area that's already seen, you know, plenty of renovation. We, t we talk about the uh, urban regeneration. So do you think this is uh, in keeping uh, with like, the government's vision, for example, that just recently launched a street art project? It is street art, but it's a very personal thing. It's on our building, but it's trying to put something back into the community. Hopefully, it makes people smile. It isn't a political statement. We're not trying to say anything big or clever. It's just a, a little bit of joy and happiness in, in this area. Yeah, and, the, and the elevation itself actually asks for something special to be done uh, with it. I mean, this is a, a, a very common route for visitors to Gibraltar. Um, and they all tend to stop for a breather as they go up and down the stairs. Uh, and to have something like that, I think, um, you know, does something different. Although not intended as such, the mural has generated some controversy, with the developers not seeking planning permission before going ahead with it. We were confident enough that people would love it. And also, sometimes if you do everything by committee, it gets watered down and Jessica wouldn't have had her free hand to do exactly what she wanted. There would have been lots of input from different people. What we will do now is go to the DPC for retrospective approval. The timing of the government's street art initiative is coincidental, but the mural will no doubt fit into the urban regeneration concept currently being promoted.